Marriage is a commitment in life where two people can find and bring out the very best in one another. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other human relationship can offer that lasts for an entire lifetime. Today signifies the creation of a new home, and not only a new home, but a new family for both of you. May you be fulfilled by each other's love, and not just love, but also a friendship. I, Kiza. Take you, Brianna Nakaya Babineau. Take you, Brianna Nakaya Babineau. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I, Brianna. I, Brianna. Take you, Keys and Fonda. Take you, Keys and Fonda. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. I give to you. I give to you. And in the presence of all of these witnesses. In the presence of these witnesses. My promise to stay by your side. My promise to stay by your side. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. I promise to love you. I promise to love without you. Reservation. Without reservation. Without reservation. To grow with you to in grow mind with and you spirit. To grow with you in mind and spirit. To always be open. To always be open. And honest. And honest. And to always cherish. And to always cherish. As long as we both As long as we both share it. Amen. Y'all give me a reason. It is with my honor to now pronounce to you, husband and wife, you make it so. This time I'd like to announce the bride and groom. and we have known the bride and groom practically their entire lives. So we found it so fitting when they asked us to do the speeches. And we know people love to hear speeches that come from the heart. And I assure you these speeches come from the heart because when these words came to our hearts, we took our notepads and we wrote them down. <laughs> Brianna, her family and I go way back. From Slidell, to Lake Charles and Lafayette. I would always tell Keeslin he would have to marry someone I liked because I knew how close he and my husband were and that I would have to deal with her the rest of my life not knowing she had been in my life all along. Most of the time people don't remember when they met any of their family members but I remember when I met my cousin Keeslin. Years later, Keeslin's father took me and my brother in. We shared the same house, bathroom, and at times the same bed. All that time formed a relationship deeper than typical cousins might have. We became more than random family members. We all became brothers. The day God decided to fill me with his spirit, Keeslin was right on the side of me crying out for it as well. So in a sense, we're like twins in the spirit. Along this journey we've traveled, and I'm elated that we can continue this journey through life together as family, officially Fontenot. 